Hey everybody, Corey here with MacCast. Today we're going to go into another screencast of iDesk Cal. Uh, it could be said faster than that, but I'm from Missouri and I got a little bit of a southern accent. Top it off, I got a little bit of lisp for some strange reason. I don't know why I was cursed with that. But uh, iDesk Cal is a great little utility app. It sits on your desktop, it shows you all your events. Uh, I've been using it for probably about a month or two now, and I have to say, for the price of $12.99, it is so worth the money. But let's let's stop talking about it here and dive right into the application. This is iDesk Cal. Okay, first thing you're going to notice is the calendar is actually in the lower left-hand corner of the screen here. And this lists everything that you have in your calendar. So for me, I have the Sync iPhone on the 25th. Matt Gasm group conference call, my parents' anniversaries, holidays, my dad's birthday, because I don't want to forget that. But if we come up here to the menu bar, we have the full list of things that we have available to us to use. So we have our basic Hashbang Industries tab that you can't see, unfortunately, here. It didn't show up. Uh, but let's open up our preferences. And this is our general preference. We can start at login. We can make it draggable, show the icon in the dock, or show the icon in the menu bar, which I choose to do generally. We can also add our hotkeys down here so we can easily access everything in the application to add events, show to do's, and manage to do's. We also have our calendar type and our display. Uh, how we want it to display, we customize everything that way. Now if we go over here and we're going to add an event and we're going to we're just going to call this complete screencast and set up a little event so you can see what happens when I add this or finish this in my calendar. I choose that it's going on my internet related work calendar and when I finish this I'm going to here I'm going to finish the time, but when I save this, you're going to watch it pop up in the left-hand corner of your screen within the application. There it is, right at the top, and it actually represents the color that I have set up for it in iCal. So now we're going to add a to-do. And this is going to show, we're going to have a way to show this here in a little bit, but Let's call this one Return, Send Back Netflix, uh, because I've been sitting on the disk for a while and I haven't had a way to remind myself. And this is going to go under my personal home calendar, and I'm going to set this for my day off, which is actually uh, coming up rather soon here on Monday. So we've got the setup. We're going to close out this window, and now you see... It's down here in the application, right here on the edge. And now we're going to launch iCal. We're going to hit our pin button down here, and you're going to see that it actually syncs up right over here in our task within iCal. This syncs across everywhere. If you have Mobile Me or you have this linked up to your Google, it's going to sync across Google as well. So what I want you to do is I want you to head over to Hashbang Industries website, which is hashbangind.com. Check out this application. It's $12.99. Give it a trial for a couple weeks. See how you like it. And we'll catch you next time.